Hey guys, how are you doing? This is Echo from Daily Fulfill. This here is one of changes in regards to VAT and e-commerce in Europe. Everyone is being affected by the global pandemic and trading has seen a shift from physical store to online shopping. As a result, e-commerce has seen a boost in terms of the growth and a large marketplace like have recorded unprecedented profits within 2020. On top of these changes, the European Union has set a date for introducing the VAT e-commerce package which includes new rules regarding to e-commerce and VAT which will take place in July. Um, before we get started, I do need uh, to make a little bit of disclaimer first. So the information contained in this video regarding the new EU 2021 VAT rules for e-commerce is for general guidance only. It should not be used as a substitute for consulting with professional tax, legal or other competent advisors. So you should consult with a professional before making any decision or taking any action. So what are main changes online sellers shipping within European Union? The first one is removal of the 2022 20, Euro import event exemption. From July 2021, the 22 Euro VAT exemption on small parcels being imported into the EU for delivery to customers will be withdrawn. This means well, this means all goods imported in the EU will now be subjected to VAT. And consider how this will impact the the price and the margins of the product. And the second is new thresholds for EU business. The unified threshold will simplify the process of VAT reporting as one threshold of 10,000 will be uh, 10,000 euro will be used for all EU European Union members. No threshold applies to non-EU business. And destination VAT can be reported and paid in a simpler in a simpler way through the IOSS the import one stop shop. It is the electronic portal business can use from 1st of July 2021 to comply with their VAT e-commerce obligations on distance sales of imported goods. It was created to facilitate and simplify the declaration and payment of VAT for goods sold from a distance by sellers from either the EU or from a non-EU country. And what is the tax rate declared by IOSS? However, each country has its own defined and specific regulation in terms of VAT rates and VAT reporting methods. And this chart is uh, for your reference. Without IOSS, shipments could, could be stopped at the border for valuation checks that may result in delivery delay or uh, additional VAT assessments. So how we act on the European Union VAT charge? First, if you are selling through online marketplace like Amazon, eBay, Wish, or AliExpress, these platforms are deemed suppliers and are supposed to collect VAT on your behalf. And for direct sellers, for example, if you run a Shopify store, the store owner is responsible for the VAT, no matter what, if you collect it or not. If you choose not to collect VAT, your customers will be charged upon delivery of the goods by the carrier. So it's best for sellers to register an IOSS number. And if you don't want to register IOSS, it also can be declared through the logistics IOSS number like Express and Yanwen. That is logistic logistics act 
as an agent to collect and pay on its behalf. And the tax is collected by the logistics in advance and is paid by the uh, paid by the logistics IOSS. According to the notification of each logistics provider, and it, uh, they are already um, applying for IOSs. And for we data fulfill, we are now registering for IOSs, so we can also help outlay the VAT charge on your behalf and uh, handle the customs clearance, and we will charge back on uh, to daily invoices. There may be more changes uh, by July and after, but it is not going to kill the e-commerce business. And all this does is just to level the playing field for EU business. UK VAT regulation has been out for a while, and I can tell you that volume for our clients to the UK market are going as strong as ever. As a, at the same point, everyone is required to pay VAT and collect VAT. All this does is even it a little bit. And it is still up to shop owners to sell great products with great marketing. That's how you win the fierce competition in e-commerce business. And we will keep updated with the latest developments as these changes take effect. So please don't miss out by subscribing to our channel. Hope this video is helpful to you and I would much appreciate if you give us a thumbs up. And if you have, and if you have any questions, please leave your comments below or join our Facebook group and contact us there. What we deliver for you provide is one-on-one -on -one VIP service for each professional dropshippers. Daily Fulfill is your solid support and you just focus on what matters. We make your business easy and we scale together. And this is Echo from Daily Fulfill and thanks for tuning in and see you soon. Bye bye.